Hey, Bola Buddies, thanks for watching. Okay, so tonight I want to talk to you about a specific bolo. Um, it's really cool and it is vintage items that do really well, but you are going to see I've got all of these bolos up here that are in the same category. So if you find something in this category, buy it, grab it, and run. Um, I'm not saying 100% of the time that if you get this item that it's going to sell for big money, but I will tell you, and as you will see, there are a lot of high solds for these items. So I am definitely going to be on the lookout and I wanted to share this with you guys. Um, subscribe below. And also if you want to be featured on my YouTube channel, Bolo Buddies down below, I'll post a link that'll tell you how to do that. And we're going to go ahead and get started here. Okay. So, um, this is what led me to start looking. So this is a vintage, um, TV tray and it's Dukes of Hazard. So Dukes of Hazard is what you're looking for. And people apparently just loved this show. I never watched it, so I know nothing about it, but I know that I am definitely going to be on the lookout for anything Dukes of Hazard. So stay tuned. You are going to be amazed at some of these sold prices. So this one is an active listing. It has 22 bids, 48 watchers, and it's currently at $59 and has one day to go. So um, that one should be interesting, but I'm guessing probably somebody picked this up pretty cheap. All right. So let's go over here and let's look at, this is a vintage Dukes of Hazard game. And it had 20 bids and sold for 103.54. And it looks, I mean, like it's just in plastic. It doesn't look like a board game or anything fancy. It just looks like something really that you might get at the dollar store or something like that. Um, but anyway, yeah, 103.54 on that one. Okay, here's another one. These are birthday invitations, guys. Looks like originally maybe $1.25. And they sold 33 bids for $152.50. This is a kid's pajama outfit, like a little uh, one-piece pajamas. $157.50, 12 bids. All of this is Dukes of Hazard. This, uh, this one I posted, I believe, in my Bolo group, or perhaps it was on another video. I know I've talked about it. Um, this is just the cigar box. And this is not for actual cigars. This is for candy, bubble gum, um, bubble gum packaging, 167.50, 37 bids. Okay. These are children's slipper shoes, it says shoes, but they're definitely slippers. Um, 188.50, 36 bids. These are socks, slipper socks. They sold for $192.51. Sorry, um, 38 bids. So they've just got like the grippies on them. This is a raincoat, a youth size raincoat. It sold for $202.59, 23 bids. You can see right here is a little better picture. Pretty amazing. Um, this is uh, a bag, a carry-all bag, 23 bids, sold for $196. This is a bubblegum pack of cigars, but this one still has the bubblegum in it. Now, I would not advise anyone to eat this bubblegum because it's very old, but it sold for $227.50 with 24 bids. All right, we have these Dukes of Hazard gloves. I can't tell if these are children's or adults. I'm guessing they're probably kids. They sold for $224.72, 31 bids. Now this is a yo-yo. So just a little, probably cheap yo-yo. Cool graphics, nice advertisement still in the package. $256.01, 20 bids. This is a whistle still in the package. And as you can see, it was a dollar originally. Amazing. And it sold for $321, 18 bids. This is 
curtain panels. Um, you can see here, they're just curtains. $320, 33 bids. This is a hat, guys, a knit hat. And it sold for $355 with 35 bids. People are really, really into the Dukes of Hazard. This is a bedding comforter that sold for $400 with 33 bids. And then we have a bath towel. And this is new. It looks to have the original um, packaging. And it sold for $455.01 with 26 bids. Then we have a bookshelf from 1981. It sold for $404.55 with nine bids. And then this is one of those kids' um, tunnel tents, which is pretty cool. It's still got the original box. It sold for $1,125, three bids. That's all it takes, guys, three bids. And then this is a poster, a garage poster, uh, toy package art, 21 bids, and it sold for $2,276. And that is the biggest one I've found so far. Now I'm gonna take you over here and I'm gonna show you, um, these are the active listings and I've got it by number of bids first. So this is the DVD TV series set, $47, currently 29 bids, 19 hours. We've got a metal garbage can going for 74. Um, I'm not sure, this is just a car and a lot of the cars go for good money too. I didn't really put those on there because I kind of feel like that's something that probably most of you already know. Here's a game still sealed, $43. Um, here's the series. Um, one through four, uh, six and seven. It's only at 1750 right now. But yeah, I'm sure there's highs and lows for this. So definitely, definitely search solds when you find an item. But if you can get it cheap, I would say just grab it. You're going to make money. Um, a lot of these things you can pick up at a thrift store, a garage sale, stuff like that. So anyway, I just wanted to share that with you and happy bolo hunting. And be sure to check out my other videos. And thanks for watching and subscribe. Thanks.